How is it going today? Look, this. My name is Dwayne. My name is Jasmine. We're a couple's wreck. And as you see, that was the best landing. I thought that I was close. I did it. Other day I she scared me. Other day she scared me. She jumped <laughs> on me. On me. Like, we deleted that part. because she deleted it? Because, like, but, she like, was about I was, to jump like, on literally, me. like, it felt like I was in a moon bounce. Like, I, like, I landed, and it just, boing, boing. <laughs> Anyway, today we have the 10 most shocking live stream moments ever recorded. And we're gonna do some live streaming later this fall, December, because we're gonna be playing a whole lot of games. Yes, because there's a whole lot of games coming out, and I'm gonna play. And we're ready. We're ready. I'm Jasmine's ready to shoot some fun. Team Dwayne. Team Jasmine. Because Jasmine's gonna get these L's. No, I'm not. So yeah, we're gonna get these headshots in SWAT in Halo next year. Thank you. So let's dive on in. Let's dive on in. And I'll please subscribe to The Riches. The Riches. For those who want more than text, <laughs> live too. streams give you an eye to almost anywhere in the world at any time. Just be warned, as uh -oh. the following examples prove, uh -oh. there can be more than a few unsettling and Ooh. strange streams going on out there. Wait, is somebody getting Yeah, off? somebody's getting around the both of those. Swatted. Oh, uh -oh. I Have heard about this. Have you ever seen our video, The Dumbest Pranks this? That Got People Arrested? You see. Then you know I... that swatting is actually a real problem. Yeah. The prank involves tricking police into storming something else. I don't know how you do home. that. While what? live streaming during a match of Counter-Strike, right. Jordan Matthewson and his viewers experienced swatting firsthand when Colorado police right. stormed his room. What? Right. Viewers yeah. viewers only watch as heavily armed police took Matthewson to the ground in a very real and potentially dangerous that, situation. That's what? crazy. Yes. I'm Wait pause right there. Pause right there. So yes, I don't know how. I don't know how. They're they're making like false reports saying that someone's trying to kill somebody, basically. Or like has a whole bunch of drugs or something like that. And just send them to their house. I don't know how you're able to get the police how to come over there with that? SWAT. SWAT your house. I guess they're saying they have like a whole bunch of bombs or something like that inside their <gasps> room, or probably playing like some something with like Call of Duty background, maybe. Because I mean, it sounds real. Right. And I guess that's how they do it. But that sucks. That's but the they can't. Can they come in your house without a uh, warrant? One warrant. Well, I I assume they have a warrant if they send in the SWAT team. If they send like a regular like police, I don't think like it's a possible they may not have it. But if you have if you have to go to that level, we have yeah. a SWAT team coming. I think they have a warrant to come yeah, in your house. Yeah. So. Wow, that's and, and that's what I'm scared about us too. When we like we if we do live stream gaming, which we'll be doing on Twitch. Right. Like, will we? Be swatted. I mean, they don't know where you live at. But they, I'm pretty sure they don't know where he lives at. And somehow they found out where he lives and actually said the SWAT there. So I don't know. I Just don't, don't know. do it. Like I, I, I can't handle jail. <laughs> you guys will go to jail because they realize it's false claim. But still, that's like crazy. Yeah, but they might put me in like holding for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, to, like right. I don't want to be in holding either. Like I, I, I don't want to hold yeah. me. <laughs> so. I'm not going to. All right. So let's dive on into All the next right. one. Intentional sex day. Unintentional sex In tape? Tangara, Brazil, the local paragliding society found out regular people what? could unknowingly make their own sex tapes. The sporting organization had installed a webcam on a nearby hill so what? that people around the world could watch the sport from the comfort of their own home. Okay, oh, anyone watching yeah. in early April 2016 wouldn't have seen paragliding, but instead a couple having sex on the hilltop. Our oh, program, the see, I thought, see, I thought, see, I thought, I'm just kidding. Right. Area. So pause right there. Okay, so so like I, I really I thought I thought they was having sex on the on the on the paragliding. I was like, wow, they wow. I was like, how are they doing that? Yeah, but now but it, just, it makes sense. On they the hilltop, the hill. yeah, they wouldn't be adventurous. They just happen to be on the wrong hill, right? With the camera. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that sucks. That really does suck. Let's dive on to the next one. Online suicide. Pranks and accidental situations are. Oh man, that sucks. Long that has to suck. Has also caught the much darker side of humanity mm. as well. Unfortunately, there's been more than one suicide attempt broadcast on a live stream. In November 2008, Abraham Biggs announced he was going to kill himself. Oh my with god. 1,500 people reportedly watching. Why would you? A 19 year old took an overdose of drugs and died on his bed. Why would Some you sit there? The whole broadcast was a prank. That ended when the camera caught police entering the room wow. and approaching Biggs' lifeless body. Oh my gosh. Childbirth. Childbirth? Watch, what? Giving birth is a natural process that occurs, obviously, many times <laughs> on a live stream? The world. Some excited That's parents wild. can record the moment to relive later. Why would One they... California father to be turned a few 
two heads and surprised his partner what? when he broadcast the birth of their child live on Facebook. While what? some people commented on how beautiful and natural the event was, others posted that it was inappropriate yes. to show, yes. rather shocking to see on Facebook. Right, don't, don't show me that. Especially, don't have me on the table. Gives All right, me yeah, I know. Shocking or bizarre, we'll let you decide. Oh my For most gosh. of us, funerals who, are the thing that follow a traditional form. Last funeral. Form. Visitation, ceremony. Now, come on now, that's you like this is right. The camera now. Some right. funeral companies are now turning to live streaming. Why? Yep, that's right. In some cases, if you are How unable to that? make it, you can take oh. a funeral. Of a oh, yeah. Okay. Well, now I understand now. Okay, now I understand now. That's okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. I understand that now. Can you imagine watching a live stream of pink drying? Exciting. Well, let's up the bizarre factor a little by telling Seriously? you that there is a live stream of what is believed to be the world's oldest burning light bulb. There's a, oh That's my. Right. If you have an so. internet connection or a smartphone, you can actually watch a 24-hour feed of the centennial bulb. <laughs> right. Which Are you serious? For 110 years in a fire station in California. Pause. Oh Pause. See me and tell me people sit there and they they watch a light bulb. People got some weird fetishes. They they want to see a light. Maybe they're actually watching actually to see if it'll go off once they watch it. I think that's why. Like I bet you if I logged into that webcam right now and that webcast and I see it, I'm like, oh, blink, it's gonna go out. It's gonna go out just cause of my luck. So, I know. But still, like, who wants to sit there and wait to see when a light bulb, the they oldest wanna light wait, bulb. They want to probably witness when the oldest light bulb goes out. Be like, I saw it. I saw it go out. I'm not. Uh, That's no on comment. them, but. Yeah, I mean, no comment. Let's dive back on it. Yeah. Drunk driving. While most live streams can be boring and pointless, in October 2015, what? one stream could have actually saved lives, what? including the person streaming it. Whitney Beal decided it would be a good idea to stream herself using the Periscope app while driving her car drunk. Okay, not only is she drunk, you want to pause? Yeah, let's, let's pause this. Not only are you filming yourself drunk, first of all, I don't know why you would do that. Second, now the police just have concrete evidence of you driving drunk now. Driving drunk and you're on your phone and you're streaming on your phone. Yeah. That was just, oh my god. While driving. While driving. That's, that's just all evidence for somebody to come lock you up. You right, know? that's crazy. That's got back on there. That's crazy. Amazingly not crashing. Police picked up on the stream and were able to track the drunk driver down Thank you. before anyone got hurt. That was stupid. See, that was straight up stupid. That's a DUI charge that Beal couldn't talk yeah. her way out of. Yeah, I bet. NASA's UFOs. Ooh, whoo. If you're into outer space, there's a good chance yeah, you're NASA. familiar with NASA's live feed from the International Space Station. Yes. In June 2015, uh -oh. conspiracy theorists and believers in alien life went wild when NASA cut the live feed moments after three strange bright light objects Whoa. were shown leaving the atmosphere of Earth. Proof Whoa. of aliens or just some strange light effects? There's more than a few uh -huh. people who think the feed was cut on purpose and the government is in on some sort of secret involving unidentified flying visitors. I Whoa. believe in aliens. I really do. Gang shooting out, man. In March 2016, Ryan oh, visited <laughs> his mother in Chicago. The 31-year-old received oh, a call to meet a friend at a corner store. While Fields waited, he live streamed himself standing on the corner waiting oh, for him man. to be an area known for gang violence. Mm -hmm. Suddenly, viewers heard numerous shots ring out and watch as Field drops his phone. The gun wow. actually comes into focus as he shot Fields numerous times. Police That's police messed up. The shooting said it wasn't a hoax and anyone watching was a first-hand witness to Chicago's terrible wow. game. Wow. So he set him up. Wow. Robbed live. Whoa. As mentioned previously, live streaming video games is pretty popular for gamers who can not only watch the game being played, yep. but see mm -hmm. the people playing via webcam. Right. In June 2014, cool. viewers watching Nikki Elise's feed were left shocked as they witnessed two men break in and rob the gamer. Whoa. Fortunately, someone really? acted quickly and called the local Tempe, Arizona police. Officers managed to immediately yes. arrest yes. one man who was found to be okay. Wow, well, that was crazy. That is crazy. I wouldn't know what to do if I'm watching a live stream and I see someone robbing them. Yeah, I wouldn't know what to do either. I'll be going crazy. That's crazy. That, that is weird. Anyway, guys, please comment below. Tell us what you think is the craziest, most shocking thing you saw on live stream. And mine is the um, UFO because I believe yeah, the government I, is. Uh, uh, harboring UF aliens? Yes, I believe in aliens. I want to go into space. That's me. I, I believe that there's no way we're the only living things in the entire galaxy. 
We will never so. know. I don't, we'll never know. <laughs> yeah. Know. Anyway, comment below. Don't forget to like. Subscribe. Like. And share some more. Alright, guys. Deuces. If you like reactions like this, what is he gonna do? What is he gonna do? What is he gonna do? Please, please. And if you like reactions like this, Hardcore. Oh Jesus, fuck! Oh, <laughs> got me skin! She's peeling me what? fucking stuff! <laughs> fuck! And if you like reactions like this, <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Make sure you become a loyalist and hit that subscribe button below. Do it! Do it now! Subscribe! <laughs>